Hello everyone and welcome to another map feature. Today I am bringing you a competitive map. This is made by Martian Mall Cop and it is called Pueblo, or as I like to call it, Pueblo. Seriously, you just need to switch the B and the E and there you go. Martian missed a golden opportunity there. Anyway, Pueblo means town in Spanish and that is what the map is based upon in terms of appearance. Martian said that its aesthetic theme takes mostly from the Mexican style of town with a little bit of the Italian style. Obviously the map looks great. I'm a sucker for Slayer maps like this where you feel like you're fighting in an actual place in which case uh, in this map it's a town. And and the map is very colorful, there are several buildings and houses all around and all of them vary from each other in terms of their design and their color. I think Martian did a really good job with the map's aesthetics, everything is visually clean, nothing's too distracting and just overall very pleasing to look at. Now on the gameplay side of things, Pueblo is basically an asymmetric map for 4 to 10 players. You can play Slayer and Strongholds on it, uh, in this gameplay obviously I'm showing Slayer gameplay. I haven't actually tried the map for Strongholds but I'm sure it'll play just as well. In this map there's basically this uh, central plaza which a lot of the action will take place on. Players will be uh, having firefights in between uh, opposite ends of this plaza and uh, that's what you're seeing in the gameplay right now. And if players don't want to traverse across the map using the plaza because uh, it is very open, they can use this uh, route over here that I'm showing in the gameplay. This is basically like the wraparound from blue spawn which is uh, kind of at the bottom of the map and it like wraps around the rest of the map onto the red spawn which is at a more elevated place and that's actually something that's kind of unique about the map is that it's continually going uphill uh, from especially if you're on blue team because you're gonna be spawning at the lower part of the map and you might uh, think that that might be imbalanced because red team immediately has the height advantage but I think it's all balanced out very well because blue team is immediately given a lot of options at the start of the game they can uh, go to their left and take a teleporter that immediately takes them to one of the highest points in the map if not the highest point they can also utilize the many different routes throughout the center of the map to get in behind the players of red team so it's all balanced out very well because of the map's layout. There are several power weapons in the map that will vary depending on the version of the map that you're playing because this map actually has two versions, a matchmaking edition and a <coughs> designer's edition. Like, uh, I'm Martian, uh, I make designer editions of maps. <laughs> as far as I know, the main difference between these two versions of the map are the power weapons in it. Uh, for example, the designer's edition, instead of having a rocket launcher, it has a custom weapon which mixed the voice tear with a Spartan laser so if you hold down the trigger on the Spartan laser it basically just fires a barrage of black holes unfortunately I don't have any gameplay of that so you'll just have to take my word for it that it is pretty cool and probably my favorite thing about the designers edition is that instead of using a gravity hammer power weapon the map instead uses this golf club it basically acts like a gravity hammer it's a one-hit kill melee weapon and it is pretty awesome so what I would recommend to the uh, more more casual player is this designer's edition just so you can have like crazy stuff like this uh, golf club and the Spartan laser void stare hybrid that I mentioned earlier but if you're one of the more sweaty player and you when you play like these slayer maps you're in it to uh, get competitive then I would recommend the matchmaking edition anyway that is pretty much it for this map showcase I hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, I will just leave you with the rest of the gameplay and I'll see you guys next time goodbye Team, halfway to victory.